Hollywood Squares reunion continues with John Davidson, Jim J. Bullock, and now the man, the myth, the voice. Yes, it's time to bring out the sexiest square ever, Shadow Stevens. <laughs> Time was it Radio City? Let me just say one thing, yeah. Jim. Uh huh. Decaf. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's intimidating to come, to come out after this guy. He's <laughs> 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 one of the funniest people I've ever seen. I had oatmeal this morning. <laughs> what can I say? It has that effect. It's oh, a God, chemical I'm telling change. you. Did we have? What was your favorite show? My favorite show um, was probably Radio City Music Hall yeah. when, when the uh, high school band came on playing New York, New York. Uh, uh, all my hair stood on end. Yeah. It's like, yeah. yeah. My life flashed before my eyes. I couldn't believe it. And I had my birthday at Radio City, too. That's, and you remember they had us awesome. downstairs and they brought us up on, on yeah, the yeah. wall of steam. Yeah. It, yeah with Rick the... pulled out all the stops. Yeah, yeah, it was sure very did. theatrical. How did you get on the show? Uh, Rick talked me into it. How did Rick find you? Oh, Rick, I've known Rick for a long time. We, um, I met him in Boston when I was there doing radio. And he was uh, a big effect in my life. He put me on television there with Dave Garraway. <laughs> Tempo Boston. Were you the only uh, announcer, though? Because you announced, which was very unusual, from the, the bottom square. Yeah. Was there another announcer originally? And then, no, then... I, I did the announcing for uh, Rick. We had a, um, because we were friends, I did it as a, as a favor to him and on the pilot. <laughs> <laughs> that was Rick. That was a, did you get paid? Do we all get paid the same? Uh -uh. Yeah, I think so, except for you, of course. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, sure. What did you make? Did you get, well, did you what get receipts? What did I make? You get <laughs> no, I, uh, how's the jewelry doing? The jewelry's doing great. <laughs> yeah. Great, thank you. That's yours. Yeah, I only yeah, wear mine. Online, yeah. well, I'm gonna wear somebody else's when I'm selling mine. <laughs> That'd be stupid, right? <laughs> Who would know? Jaja. <laughs> Jaja. John, one of the great things about the show was that the combination of these two guys for me was a transition in in my life. I idolized Shadow Stevens. I thought this is the most centered, the most yeah. uh, confident, but not in an egotistical way. <laughs> but I wanted to be like I wanted to be like Shadow. I, yeah. I wanted to have that kind of confidence, and I wanted to be as crazy as Jim J. Bullock. Yeah. So the combination of the <laughs> it was a it was a big thing in my life. I'm serious. I'm not making you unserious. <laughs> I, I really I want to be like Shadow. But what about now you were both sex I wanted what? to be like Joan. <laughs> 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 that explains a lot of things. <laughs> Clears it up for me. It, you, but you became the big sex oh, But what, oh the first week you were on, all the letters started coming in, right? All the women. And then it was in New York you were mobbed? N New York made me afraid. Yeah, you know? yeah. The, the women yeah, really I felt really clumsy. <laughs> clumsy? Yeah. Why? Oh, it was, uh, it was something I wasn't prepared for. Yeah, oh, and you were just newly married and your wife used to come by and with the she baby. She loved it, yeah. And, was, and the baby was always dressed. It was such a homey show. We all were such a family, you know? Now there's two, now he has two kids. I know, I know. I, he still sends Christmas cards, which you don't. I know. Uh, that's a, what about the time you, you were in Radio City and you asked Jim not to do something, John? Asked him not to do something? Not to call you something. <laughs> you remember. No. You no. tell him. All right, you tell him. Well, remember I was always calling you stupid? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And brain dead. <laughs> brain dead. <laughs> did I say don't, did I say? Yes, don't you really? remember? I used to do it all the time in the studio, and we were at Radio City with 6,000 people out there. He was there. sensitive, though. He was a sensitive Yeah, host. and I was calling you stupid and brain dead in front of 6,000 people, and you came and you knocked on my door very politely. <laughs> I and I, I was in that. my fishnets. Remember? I <laughs> <laughs> no, But you asked me, you know, you said, I don't mind you calling me stupid oh, in the studio God. audience, but please don't call me stupid in front of 6,000 people. <laughs> no, I, I think that I, I think I was hurt by that. Were well, you hurt by it? Yeah. Well, did I hurt I, I, you? I'm a sensitive person. I, I, I felt that I, people would think I was really <laughs> stupid. John, I never meant to hurt you. <laughs> I, oh, God. Isn't that funny that I was sensitive? <laughs> it's, it's been, come back, Jim, come back. <laughs> all I right, think I was Shadow, sensitive. All the guests, we've all been saying, who was your favorite? Who was your favorite of all the guests that came through? Or one that you really remember as being memorable? 
Well, actually, my fun the funniest times on Hollywood Squares for me was um, Jim Bullock and uh, and Jaja, I think, or Jim <laughs> Bullock Jaja. and you, uh, or Jim Bullock and uh, Elf. Yeah. It was always some combination with Jim. Yeah. So, uh, I Funny think he's one of the funniest fun people on television. Elf on Squares and not on the show itself. Why was that? I don't know. That's Writers. Because they weren't paying me. Alpha wasn't paying me. Well, you were doing your own lines. And yeah. yeah. Now, yeah, Howard right. Stern was on. I don't remember Howard being on. Howard, uh, yeah. Howard sat in for me, and I sat I in for John. I was there that day. I pulled my back. It's the only taping I missed, and Shadow was hosting, and it was apparently... Did we get lots of letters about that? No, because it, well, he, we must Howard have... Howard thought he was in hell. Yeah, He yeah. said, how do you do this? Yeah. I don't know how to do this. Yeah. It, it's... How do I get out of here? <laughs> yeah. And then I hosted once too, and yes. I had a great time. Did you ever host? Mm hmm. I hosted uh, for two weeks while you were you had hurt your back. <laughs> Supposedly. Well, <that's> <laughs> <laughs> I did. I had a, I, oh, I was in the hospital. More like this. I was. No, no. <laughs> Coming up next, coming up next, the producer of Hollywood Squares who enjoyed us with some behind-the-scenes stories, so stay with us. <laughs>